today I'm going to be doing my top box unboxing as well as my boxy charm unboxing. So yeah, this one is definitely heavy this month. And I realized that this is actually my November unboxing, which really sucks because this box took forever. And honestly, this one didn't take very last time too. This took forever as well. So honestly, this one just got here. So yeah, let's start with the top box. So as you guys know, the top box is the Canadian like Etsy. So this is what it is in here. So let's just start off with this small little thing here. And this is Nude by Nature. This is the creamy matte lipstick. And this is in the color Grapevine. It's very small looking. I think it's a very little lipstick, but I think it's full size. That's what the packaging looks like. Oh, this is a very pretty color. It smells nice. This is what it smells like. It literally smells like lipstick. This is what the color looks like. Yes, I know. I don't normally do swatches of lipstick, but I am going to keep this one because I kind of thought it'd be fun. That's a really nice color. So then there is this here. What is this? Juicy Couture. What? There's something from Juicy Couture in here? Okay, so this is called Gold Couture. Oh, the only thing I know about Gucci, Gucci, it's not Gucci, Juicy Couture is their perfume that they still have. And I think they used to have like those like Havel, oh, it's a perfume. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's super cute. And it's a little roll bottle. Let's see if it smells good, I don't really. Oh. That smells really good. I don't normally like getting perfumes in these boxes. Normally they're little sample sizes. This is obviously like a deluxe sample size. That smells really good. So I think I'm actually gonna keep that one as well. Normally I get rid of half the boxes. Um, so the next thing is, is from Medusa's Makeup. And this is a vegan cruelty free. Oh, this is a lip balm, tinted lip balm. And this is in Social. I like this packaging. I can get into it. Chances are it's lots of no. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's it. I'm just gonna rip it. So this actually looks, oh, that's so cute. It's like a little matte lip tube. Okay, so this is a tinted lip balm. So let's see how tinted it is. Oh, it's barely tinted. It's got a teeny tiny little bit of tint. So that one is it here. I don't know if you can see that. It's very, very light. Um, honestly, I'm probably gonna keep that too. I don't really, wow, top box, you've been killing it to this. And last thing in here is from Bioderma, and this is, it says 24 hour hydration, ultra nutrient, ultra neutralizing. Oh, this is a shower oil for sensitive skin. This is, this is a body wash, okay. It's for dry and irritated sensitive skin. What does it say directions are? For the shower or bath, apply on wet skin and rinse. Okay, so it's it's a body wash. Oh, that's really good. I thought it was a face wash for a minute and I was like, oh, not another face wash because we get quite a few of them in here, but that's awesome. Wow, that's pretty crazy from all these products this month. I'm keeping all of them. That is something that does not happen very often. And the box of charm. This is heavy, so let's see what's in here. I'm gonna show you what, it, oh, things are falling. Okay, so that's your first look at it. I don't really know what's in here. Ooh, okay, so this month it is invite only. That's the card. I'm smelling something in here. Okay. So let's just jump in with the first things that I see and these are really cute. These are from Lily Lashes and these are in the Falling For You is what the, I guess they're called. And it's, there's like a little fall package. Those are really cute. These are a $28 pair of lashes. <laughs> that's, a, that's expensive for lashes, but they're cute. Then let's go with this here and this is from Kate Somerville. I actually really love Kate Somerville. 
I don't buy anything from Kate Somerville. I've been getting some stuff in my uh, like top boxes and boxy charms and stuff and I would, would like to buy her stuff. It's expensive though. But this is the goat's milk moisturizing cleanser and this is the face cleanser. So it's face wash. So it comes like this in this tube. This I this is I think the item I picked to be honest. This is a $40 face wash. Yeah. <laughs> so yes. Which is why I picked this one. <laughs> okay, and then I got these two things down here, which I have no idea what they are. They are from Vitamin Vitas Vitamask. I don't really know. They look very weird. Okay, these this one's called Glow Juicy Berries. And this one's called Nutria Nutriish Flower Nectar. Um, how to use these. Wash, cleanse face apply um, remove the mask from the package okay so these must be sheet masks okay these are biodegradable sheet and eco packs oh that's why the packs feel so weird okay so they're biodegradable face masks and pouches so this is completely all biodegradable let's um, check to see what the prices of these are so the I think for the two of them, they're $18. Ooh, there's hibiscus in this one, the flowers. Nice. All right, well, that's not bad. I will definitely like those. So then I have two more items in here, and this one's the next one here, and this is from Milk Dew, I think it's called. No, it's from Glow, Glow, Glow Oasis? Glow Oasis, I think it's called. This is the Milk Dew pH Balancing Moisture Milk Toner. Let's take a look at this. Never heard of this brand before, so. I have a feeling this is why it was so heavy. Oh yeah, that is why it was so heavy. This is glass. Actually, that's really cute. Let's just, oh, what the, do I have to break this? I don't even know. What the hell? I don't know how to get stuff out of here. Okay, well. I'm gonna figure out how to pop whatever the heck this is out of here. I don't know if you pop this little thing in or you just hold, take the whole thing out. I don't really know, but that is very cute. I like this bottle. And I like toner, so I will use this. This is $34 for toner. Yeah, that's expensive. But I mean, I'm gonna use it, I have it, if I could get into it. <laughs> Like it's got this like I don't understand. I don't know if you're supposed to pop that out or if you're supposed to pop it in or take it out. Oh, I think you just take it. Oh, okay, okay, you take it out. Oh, wow! I'm such a genius, aren't I? Okie dokie. Okay, it smells nice. <laughs> okay, so there's that. <laughs> and then the last thing in here is from Violet Voss, and this is. The Violet Sunset. So apparently it's got 10 shades in here. I didn't keep the last Violet Voss palette we got because there's like the essentials and there's like greens and stuff in here. So we'll see. I don't know what this one looks like. This is the from a Pro Series. Oh, okay. So this is what it looks like. I like this one. This would be a great palette to bring with you on a vacation because you've got like the peach, the vanilla, the champagne, and then you've got like the lighter browns, the pinks, the purples, and then like the dark browns. That's actually a really nice palette. Ooh, I'm definitely keeping this one. This violet sunset is calling my name. Oh yeah, that's what it looks like there. Yes, this is a nice palette. This is actually one I'm going to keep. I really have wanted to try Violet Boss, and I haven't really bought anything from her brand so yeah I'm gonna put that in there okay so the Violet Voss palette is $37 American so all these prices are in American everything else is a little bit more expensive here in Canada but yeah so there is that so the total of everything is gonna be on the screen uh -huh. so I think that was worth it this month was really good I See, this is what I'm saying. I say this every single time. So what happens, I don't know why I clapped for emphasis there. 
Um, this is what happens to me. I decide I'm gonna cancel and then they give me a box like this where I like everything. And then I am like, okay, I'm gonna keep my BoxyCharm subscription. And then they go and do something and give me like a bunch of stuff that I hate. Okay, or don't like, whatever. Sorry, hate's a strong word. And then like there's boxes where I literally will only keep one thing out of the whole box. And then the next box, they'll be like, and then they go like this and they give me a whole box of stuff that I like again. So, uh, boxy charms playing with my emotions, that's for sure. All right, well, well, that was everything for November's <laughs> boxy charm and top box, even though it is now December. Hopefully, my boxy charm for December doesn't take a whole month to get here. I do not know what why it took so long. It could be because of all the flooding in Vancouver or in BC, but I don't think so because the way it comes up, I don't think it actually comes through. Maybe it does come through a different province. I don't know. Anyway, enough of that. That was everything. And I am very happy that these boxes finally showed up and are here. And I am very happy with everything that came in them. I hope you guys are staying safe and I hope you guys have a great day. 